Churchill was always deeply impressed by Franklin Roosevelt. Their relationship started not particularly well in 1918. Um, Roosevelt thought that Churchill was pretty insufferable. Uh, and of course, in 1940, uh, he said uh, to his cabinet that, well, he said, I suppose Churchill is the best man Britain's got, even if he is drunk half his time. Um, well, he didn't change his views about Churchill's drinking habits, but um, he did, uh, they did come to develop a real personal respect. Uh, for example, uh, driving around this estate uh, in Roosevelt's famous car, which of course was specially adapted so he could do it all with his, his hands because he couldn't use his legs. Uh, Roosevelt enthusiastically showed Churchill around the estate. Churchill spent most of his time just wondering if the president could really keep his grip and gesture at the same time. Uh, I think he felt at times it was one of his most dangerous moments of the war. Um, 